If you're looking for a video surveillance system, you've probably come across two different storage options. A digital video recorder, which is a DVR, or a network video recorder, which is an NVR. The main difference between both NVRs and DVRs is how they process video data and what cameras can connect to them. A DVR system can only work with coax or analog cameras. They're often cheaper because they're lower resolution and they've got less features than IP cameras. A coax camera will send the video data to the DVR via a coax cable and the DVR itself then processes the video into a digital format so it can be viewed. Coaxial cables do have some limitations though. They tend to be wider and more rigid than Ethernet cables, which can make installation quite challenging. As well as this, the image quality begins to degrade at about 90 metres, which means the uh, camera needs to be closer to the DVR. In an NVR system, an IP camera captures the video and sends it back to the recorder. That can either be done wirelessly over a Wi-Fi network or via a wired Ethernet connection. IP cameras tend to have higher resolution capabilities than a traditional analog camera. As well as this, uh, they're also capable of sending and recording audio, uh, which the majority of analog cameras can't do. Both NVRs and DVRs provide a reliable local storage option, but depending solely on local storage can be risky because if your recorder malfunctions or is stolen, then you've lost the crucial video evidence that you need. Videoloft is a cloud platform that's compatible with hundreds of brands of cameras and recorders, including Hike Vision, Dower, Uniview, Lorex and many more. A Videoloft cloud adapter can connect to an NVR and DVR and back up the recordings to the cloud, or it can even allow you to replace an NVR completely and record directly from IP cameras straight to the cloud. Videoloft also comes with a whole host of other features, including centralised footage, multiple viewing options, multiple user permissions and more, all whilst being really bandwidth friendly.